Lots of things affect the rotation of the Earth. Foremost among them is the sloshing of oceanic tides on and off the continental shelves. These tides are primarily raised by the moon, and so the Earth and the moon do this kind of ballet. Where the moon raises the tides, the tidal bulge of the Earth actually speeds the moon up in its orbit, forcing it to ascend in its distance from us. So the moon is actually spiraling away from us. Not by much, a few centimeters a year. And how do we know that? Well, you can calculate what it would be, given this dual dance that's going on, or you can stick mirrors on the moon, beam a laser to it, time the return trip, and calculate how far away the moon is which is exactly what we did with Apollo 11 back in 1969. Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin laid down what are called corner reflectors. Light coming in from any direction will reflect back exactly parallel to the direction the light came in. And so you come back to Earth, beam a laser out of your telescope, check the flash on its way back, time it, and there you have it. We confirmed that in fact the moon is spiraling away from Earth, as it's been doing for billions of years. The moon used to be much closer and much bigger in the sky.